evening everyone my name is Aaron back with a brand new video and a brand new episode of album slash EP reaction slash review last time we did 21 pilots blurry face this time we're going to be doing Allison Chain's Rainier Fog I have not heard this album I've heard um Black Gives Way Blue and the, the Devil Put Dinosaur here both very fucking good albums um yeah no I, I really think they they're doing well post lane um so far um, I think both albums are pretty good. Anyways, let's get into it. First song is called The One You Know. Okay. Ooh, okay, that's nice. Okay, the harmonies are are on point. Yes, that's very good. I like how they do change the sound with each album. All of this this does sound like um they really did change significantly after um after the self titled album. Yeah, no um, and I think they've stuck with that sound for the last ten plus years, and I think it's worked out for them. Yeah, that was the first song, um, the one you know, and hell yeah, no, um, I like the, the sort of dark sound that they're going for on this album, I think it's going off really well. The guitar solo was great, as always, Jerry Cantrell is great at guitar solos and guitar riffs. Absolutely, no. And the harmonies are great, and William's voice really shines, is really shining a good amount on this 9.5 out of 10. Next song is the title track, Rain Your Fog. All the while, it still feels like Alf and Chains. Are those lyrics about Lane Staley? The, um, with you here we shared a space? Like, that's always half empty? Like, something like that? Grinding and grinding it all. Was that a reference to the, to the song Grind or, or something? Holy shit. <laughs> That was the title track, Rain Your Fog, and uh, fuck yeah, absolutely great. That was on point. Also, the drums sound sound really clear, sound really crisp and nice, and I love that a, a good amount. That's that's really fucking nice. Um, and yeah, this is this song about Lane Staley. Like, I guess you um never really get over something like that, you know. So, um, yeah, no, I, I feel it. Just, oof. One hell of a loss, <laughs> for sure. Anyways, yeah, no, this is, um, another good fucking song. 10 out of 10. I like everything about it. The riffs are nice. And William's voice is good. I, I think William's voice is a good fit for them. And I, th I don't think it's bad at all. Alright, next song is Red Giant.
Yeah, that was Red Giant, and honestly, it was kind of boring. The riff was good, the rest kind of felt a little bit more meh, and eh, overall. It's an okay song, it's just got a little bit of meh to it. I don't know. I wouldn't choose to listen again, but I wouldn't turn it off if someone put it on, you know? Yeah, that's about it. Um, 7 out of 10, it's alright. Next song is Fly. It's not my favorite thing, but you know, it's pretty good, still pretty good. Yeah, no, I like that one quite a bit. Definitely more than the last song for sure. Um, yeah, no, it slaps, absolutely. Um Good shit, boys, good shit. <laughs> Eight out of ten. Yeah, pretty good. Next song is called Drone. It's pretty long. That was Drone, and, um, yeah, good song, um, I enjoyed how long it was, it didn't feel like it was longer than it was, for sure. And once again, the solo, Dre or Cantrell is good at writing solos. Yeah, no, um, this is a good one for sure, absolutely. 10 out of 10. Um, next song is Deaf Ears, Blind Eyes. That was Deaf Ears, Blind Eyes, and, um, another nice song, but it did go on a bit too long for me, but it's not bad at all, it's just, I feel like it went on for just a little bit too long. Um, I feel like that about this record in general. Um, some of the songs, they're okay, but they feel like they can go on, they can drag on a bit too long, and that kind of ruins it for me a little bit. But there's nothing here that's outright horrible. It's just 
It's a little bit, you know, what I'm, you know what I mean, right? Nothing bad here though. This is this is all right. Nine out of ten. Next song is maybe. That was, um, maybe, and yeah, fuck yeah, that's, it's a really nice one. Really nice, slow, solemn one. I really like that one. I like everything about it. I enjoy the lyrics, just, fuck yes. 11 out of 10. I don't know. It's a good one. Next song is So Far Under. All right. Maybe I was wrong about this record. Fuck yes. <laughs> that was really fucking good. So far under. Fuck. To the yes. Words cannot describe. Just, oh my god. The pure enjoyment I got out of that. That was pure amazingness. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. 12 out of 12 songs. That was really fucking good. Ugh. Next song is Never Fade. John Kenny is a really good drummer. It doesn't feel like it's about Lane Staley again. That was Never Fade, and that was a very nice, enjoyable one. Nice vibes. Um, I think it's about Lane Staley, yeah. Mainly because of the title, it would appear that way. I would think. I think it's about Lane Staley. I don't think I'm wrong about that. Really good stuff here, absolutely. Nice feeling song. 12 out of 12. I, it's, no, 13, yeah, 12 out of 12. Last song is called All I Am. Ooh. 
that's it. That was all I am, and fuck yes. What a nice ending to this album. The song like this can't go wrong, absolutely. I loved every single second of that. Absolutely. <sighs> the song feels a bit sad, and I don't know why. I don't even know what it's about. It just feels sad for some reason. Probably because the meaning of it is probably sad. I don't, I don't know. 11 out of 10. Perfect ending to this album, I think. Just everything about it is just really nice. Very nice. Everything about it. And to rate the album, this is pretty good. Some of the songs do drag on a bit too long, but nothing actually feels like it's downright horrible. Maybe it's just a bit too long, in my opinion. But still, the songs, all in all, just blend so well together, and it doesn't feel like it's too long or anything. The album and all does not feel like it's too long or anything like that. And, um, Jerry Cantrell's solos are good. The harmonies are good as well. And, yeah, no. Everything about it is really good. All in all, a 10 out of 10, I'm feeling on this one. Absolutely. That's pretty great. That's going to do it for this video. Think, create, most probably stay alive. And next time, I don't know what we're doing. We might be doing this. This long motherfucker right here. But I don't know for sure. You'll have, we'll have to find out. But yeah, no, I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared of this shit. I don't know if, if that was next but or not, but... It is scheduled for next, but I don't know if I'm ready. Just... Alright, anyways, see you in the next video. Think, create, most probably stay alive. See y'all. Peace out.